How much time in a day do you spend on your devices? An hour, a few hours, or maybe even several hours in a day? This is for anyone that would like to cut down on that screen time. Personally, I feel that I should cut down on my screen time because I usually spend around six to eight hours on my phone. All, because of that, I in the past have set time limits on my social media, which is what I'm usually on when I'm on my phone. So that way I wouldn't spend such an excessive amount of time on, the, on those apps on my phone. An excessive amount of screen time can be unhealthy for you and even your eyes. But there are plenty of ways that you can help that can help you limit or in other words reduce that screen time on your devices. Three ways to do this is by finding a new hobby, relaxing, or even setting a screen time limit on your phone. The first way that you could limit your screen time is by finding a new hobby. You can do this by trying different things that you may like that don't include being on a device, such as working out at a gym or even working out at your own house. As it's, um, according to an article that Savoir Bayoua wrote, getting a new hobby can help you cut down on screen time that could be used to do something productive. Therefore, finding a new hobby in place of being on your devices can help you minimize your screen time and help you do something productive, which on a positive note can turn you into a more productive type of person if you pile on those hobbies instead of being on your phone. Another way that you can limit the amount of time you spend on a screen is doing something as simple as relaxing. As it says in the article that Baywa wrote, the idea of relaxing has been shifted from laying down and taking a nap to scrolling through your phone for hours. I happen to agree with this because I seem to call scrolling through my phone for hours on end relaxing. When really it doesn't keep me relaxed at all and I should use that time to lay on the couch, take a nap, or even go swing on the porch outside. This way, I'm not on my phone and my mind is able to calm down and refresh itself. Yet another way to reduce your screen time. The final and quite the easiest way to reduce your screen time is literally by going to your settings and setting a screen time limit. A screen time limit is where you can choose one or multiple apps to set time limits of how long you can be on those apps in a day. Brandon Russell wrote that wrote an article over these screen time limits and said that a screen time limit it will notify you before you hit your limit and when you hit your limit it will restrict you to it will restrict the access that you have to that app. Of course there is a way that you can extend that limit by 15 minutes or completely ignore the, ignore that limit. However, if you can stop yourself from doing that, then you will reduce your screen time majorly. I've done that from experience. Um, an example of this would be if you set a two hour or an hour, an hour and a half limit on Facebook. When you are close to meeting that limit, it will notify you. Then when you hit that limit, it will restrict you from being on the app unless you choose otherwise to extend or ignore it. Um, finding a new hobby, relaxing, and even setting a simple screen time limit on your apps are just three ways that you could possibly reduce and or limit your screen time on your devices each day. Utilizing these ways can be beneficial to you because spending too much time on screens can have quite a few negative effects physically and socially, such that it could hurt your vision, give you headaches, or even affect the way that you socialize with the others around you. Therefore, if you ever find yourself with hours and hours of screen time and you want to fix it, then try out these tips. Thank you for listening and have a nice day.